Yesterday's College Station School Board election was anything but ordinary. Ordinary is the last word to yeah, describe definitely. it. definitely. Candidates Mike Nugent and Philip Garrett both received 2,012 votes, leaving them with agony and exhaustion. Reporter Shada Nazifpour gets the in inside scoop on how both of the candidates are feeling. Every we vote joke. counted last night and each of us needed just a few more. 2012 is a number that will haunt Mike Nugent and Philip Garrett, the two candidates competing for a school board position. We would jokingly throw that out. Well, what if it ended in a tie? And you don't ever really think it's serious. But then when you saw the numbers there, it, it, it was pretty surprising. Now both candidates will have to wait 11 to 13 business days, something Nugent isn't looking forward to. It's a waiting game. You have to be patient. I, I don't like being patient, but that's, it's just a reality. If you ever thought my vote doesn't matter, this is a perfect example that every vote does count, and your vote could have broke the tie. Every vote counts, one vote can make a difference, and unfortunately for us, at this, both of us, our first election, it happened to us this time. So. Philip and Nugent both found out last night exactly how long it's been since a tie like this has happened in College Station. It's been 30-something years ago in College Station for a school board position, but outside of that, no one last night could remember it happening in, in the local area. This is going to matter. Uh, we just had no idea how much it would matter. In College Station, Shada Nazifpour, KAGS HD News. The votes are now up to the seven provisional ballots from College Station ISD precincts, as well as two overseas ballots that are out as well. We should know the winner no later than 13 business days from today.